So if you would like to add Nearpod as an external tool, what we were going to do is we're going to do similar to what we've done with Kami, which is you're going to go to your settings in the course that you want to add Nearpod. Remember, you're going to have to do this with every course that you want to integrate um, this into. So once you're into the settings, you're going to go to apps. And this is where it's a little different than Kami. If you did that, we can actually search for Nearpod and find it here. And you're going to click on that. And we're going to add app. And here you need the consumer key and the shared secret. So I sent you a link in the email with this video and it's going to look like this. You're going to click on this generate consumer key and shared secret and that's going to pop up. You're going to copy your consumer key, drop it in, go back, copy your shared secret, drop it in and add app. And so now it will be available for you when you're doing assignments to choose that as your external tool type. Um, and so yes, you'll come down here, you'll choose external tool, you'll hit find, and we'll look for Neopod. Oops. And then it's gonna take me to my Neopod dashboard to where I'm gonna say that yes, I'm gonna do that. I think you only have to do this the first time. We're gonna log in with your account, with your school account. Okay, once that pulled up, I can see the lessons that I have in my library and I can choose them and I'm going to choose, probably we're going to choose student paste and then that's going to put that, um, that directly into the assignment type um, for the student.